What are you telling me, bro? I'm good, man. I'm good. Um, just happy that the the international break is is it over? Because I'll tell you what, life is like it's so boring, isn't it? Like you just, I don't know. You just, there's no vibes. There's just nothing. It's just yeah, watching a finished 37 year old Cristiano Ronaldo doesn't really it don't really tickle my pickle anymore. Oh, like bro. unless it's an international competition, like actually the World Cup or the Euros, I just don't even see the point. Like. Yeah. I'd rather watch Conte's football with 33% possession against Nottingham Forest than that shit. Bro, I'll be honest, yeah. Like, I'm I'm hearing even Portugal fans don't even want Ronaldo to start no more, bro. Like, they're stressed, fam. Like, I, <laughs> it, it, you know what, yeah? It's sad, isn't it? Because, you know what I mean? Everyone knows. Listen, I don't mind being right, in it. Like, I don't mind being right, in it. But it just feels... I, I don't know. I've got to the point with Ronaldo where... I wouldn't say that I feel bad because I don't. That's not the right word, but I don't know. It's bittersweet, bruv, because he's, bruv, seeing a man look this bad, yeah, like, I don't get any, bro, I don't get any pleasure out of seeing him look this shit, though. Like, I'll be honest. What do you, what do you think it's down to? Do you think it's, like, poor form? He's, it's you know, not, he's not form, bro. Not he's game. crap, bro. <laughs> like, bro, like, do you think it's, like, he's just the game's too fast for <laughs> <it> now? <laughs> bro, he's like, rubbish, well, bro. Like, bro, like, man, man, gotta understand. It's not that the game's too fast for him, yeah. It's that he's too slow for the game. <laughs> that's, that's what it is. <laughs> like, is bro, because well, you look at like people like Luka Modric who are the same age, and he can still put yeah. in a man of the match performance. And he, yeah, and he's bro, like, bro. even Zlatan, Zlatan's forty. Like, yeah, but and there bro, is a little bit of you that but is, these are all technically right. good footballers that you're mentioning. Ronaldo's not a technically good footballer, bro. And I've said it for a long time. He was the original pace and power merchant, bro. And now he's got mm. no pace and power. You're seeing just how mediocre of a footballer he is. And, and this is what it is. Like, he's always been a, an exceptional athlete and a mediocre footballer. That's what he's always been, bro. Same with Mo Salah. Mo Salah's another one. He's an exceptional athlete and a mediocre footballer. And as soon as he would loses you put, that would you put explosiveness, Gareth Bale in that category? Media, no, because Gareth Bale's technically a million miles away from these men, bro. Have you seen Gareth Bale's free kicks and that, bro? And the way he strikes a ball, bro. Ronaldo can't strike a ball like Gareth Bale. Never in his life, bro. Thing, see, the thing is, because obviously Bale are heavy, heavily reliant on pace and power. Yeah, but now, Bale's got tech, bro. Like, do you know what I'm saying? Like, Bale has got real man tech, bro. Bale will cut in, yeah, and whip the ball in the top corner from 30 yards, bro. Gareth Bale has that. Ronaldo's got this knuckleball technique that he used to do where he hits the ball as hard as possible, yeah? And the ball, he doesn't know where it's going and it goes in, bruv. That's what he used to do. Do you know what I mean? Like, when Ronaldo was scoring free kicks, yeah, not a single free kick did he ever know where it was going. He just hit it as hard as he could and hoped for the best, bro. And then guess what? He can't do them no more, bro. It was the ball the whole time. That man was saying, oh, yeah, hit the valve and the ball moves. and He don't know where the ball's going. Yeah, that's, that's, fucking... that, that, that whole Valve shit was bollocks. Bro, it's, it's pot luck, bro. Like, what Gareth Bale does does is not luck, bro. Gareth Bale picks the top corner and puts it in the top corner, bro. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's not the same. It's not the same. Like Ronaldo's free yeah. kick technique was 100% fluke, bro. He just hit it hard, bro. That's it. What do you think of Portugal? Because they've, they've got, like, some... They've got some ballers. They've got, like, obviously Cancelo, Bernardo Silva... We're not Manager needs to go jail, bruv. That's what I think of Portugal. Manager needs to go jail, bro. I watched the game yesterday. Bro, he needs to go jail. Yeah, I mean, I, I can't lie. I, I, I watched some of the game and I just thought, I thought it was a bore fest. Mm. Most international game. I'd rather, the only international games that really um, I enjoy watching at the moment is the yeah. South American teams. Mm. Like, I had more enjoyment watching on the Bet365 app, Qatar versus Chile. Mm. Then Portugal versus Spain. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, I hear you, bro. And then you I get you. you see you see my guy Richarlison stat padding against the the uh, the plumbers. We're shameless, but I don't care. He's getting no, he's a baller. He's, though, he's a baller. He's getting in form just in time before that mm. North London derby. I think yeah. he's got what four goals in his last two games. But we oh, need to oh, talk. Shit. We need to discuss something as well because. I want to hear your thoughts on this because I've had so many arguments with these weaves on Twitter about Harry Kane, right? Okay. Where does Harry Kane rank in the England players for you? All well, the all players of all time. time. No, just current the current squad. Well, he's the best player. Like, where else would he rank? 
Right, exactly. But according to rival fans, all he's done his whole England, England career is stat pad. Even though he's got more... He has, yeah, but goals. that's not his fault. <laughs> like, yeah, he's, yeah, he, he can only he's score he's goals, bro. He's stat padded, but he's also got, you know, World Cup golden boots. He's captain England. Yeah, and, and that four penalties, that, he's stat padded that as well. But I mean... Bro, <laughs> like, the disrespect this guy's getting is, is nah, ridiculous. Listen, Harry Kane, yeah, is England's best player based on his consistent high level of performances probably for the last, I don't know, five, six years or something like that. He is England's best, in it? So I don't know why Harry Kane's getting stick, bro. Like, getting, bro, there's so many things wrong with the though. England squad and Harry Kane's not one of them. Like, I'll be honest. Like, I don't know why a man can talk about Harry Kane. It, it might be a penalty, but that penalty against Germany was absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, that, that was a joke penalty. That was a joke penalty still. Like, he's, he's only, only playing the team that could make a penalty look like a screamer. <laughs> yeah. 